Fats can be both good for you and bad for you. For example, omega-3 fatty acids, an unsaturated fat, helps your brain function normally and are also known to be anti-inflammatory. On the other hand, saturated fats raise the level of unhealthy cholesterol in your blood and it may put you at a higher risk of heart disease and stroke. Let's take a look at the difference between saturated fats, unsaturated fats, and trans fats. A fat molecule is composed of a three carbon glycerol head and three fatty acid tails. The tails are a chain of carbons bound to hydrogen atoms. This is called a hydrocarbon chain. When all the carbons are bound to hydrogen, you have a saturated fat. All bonds between the carbons and hydrogen are single, which creates a straight shape. Due to the straight shape, saturated fats are solid at room temperatures. Examples include animal fats. An unsaturated fat has a hydrocarbon chain that contains carbon atoms that bind to each other with a double bond. These double bonds bend the unsaturated fat, which makes the fat less compact, and they're usually liquid at room temperatures. Examples include plant and fish fats. An unsaturated fat with one double carbon bond is a monosaturated fat. An unsaturated fat with a multiple double carbon bond are polyunsaturated fats. An unsaturated fat that has the hydrogen atoms on opposite sides of the carbon is called a trans fat. This creates a structure that is more similar to a saturated fat and results in an unsaturated fat that is solid at room temperature. Trans fats are not healthy fats. They increase the bad LDL cholesterol and lower the good HDL cholesterol. Kind of a double whammy. In general, unsaturated fats are healthier than saturated fats and trans fats. Some unsaturated fats help the nervous system and decrease, decrease the risk of heart disease by decreasing the bad LDL cholesterol and increasing the good HDL cholesterol. I hope that was helpful. Thanks for watching. And remember, kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today.